If this is real, this could potentially be one of the best days ever. Forget Christmas, forget paid vacations at work. This day might be the greatest of all time. Today I woke up to quite a few people tagging me on Twitter, like this person right here. So the fact that it was in my face as soon as I opened the app, I was like, this is interesting. And the reason why this video didn't come out sooner or as soon as it dropped is because I was looking for proof. I was looking, well, where is this rumor coming from? What law did he break? And we're going to get into all of that right now. We got this post with almost 4 million views in a few hours. Cake streamer Neon is being sentenced to one year in prison in Dubai for illegally filming. And we get drama alert. Keemstar saying Neon has not been arrested to one year in jail. This is not true. If Neon goes to jail for a year for being a complete douchebag and harassing people in public, what I celebrated, yes, that is hilarious. And I think that's one way to teach all of these goofy ass streamers to stop messing and stop harassing innocent people i think that would send a good message to all of these annoying ass twitch streamers kick streamers that just harass people because they're nine years old and they think it's a funny thing to do mess with innocent people so this is the moment where he allegedly got arrested and was on his way to jail all cameras are off i just want to let you know we're trying to work with you guys i'm really sorry if we can't film it it's a problem we can we can just leave if that's a but the people, the, the people, uh, the guest uh, services said we're okay. If it's not okay, we can leave. We, we don't want the, problems. We go to the office and after the after you take it. Okay, Give me all let's. Your ID. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. I'm so sorry, sir. So I understand that um, it's not official, right? We going to jail. We going to jail. Where are we going? To the office, they said. Bro. But we went to guest services. Yeah. That's where... Okay, guest services is where we got permission, ma'am. I want to let you know. And I started to look into it because I'm not from Dubai. Believe it or not, I don't live there. <laughs> so I don't know the laws. You know, just one simple Google search tells you everything you need to know. It says filming permits in Dubai are required by anyone who are looking to film in public places. They can be obtained by the Dubai Film and Television Commission. And then it says you do not require a filming permit for weddings, events, educational purposes, colleges and schools press conference and any filming for personal use now what neon was doing in dubai it wasn't for personal use it certainly was not educational it was to live stream on kick in front of 10,000 body people this is his kick page he was pretty active nine days ago nine days ago on that grind eight days ago six days ago and he hasn't posted anything to kick since last week which gives a whole arrest for one year a little bit more credibility shouldn't it be common sense if you travel to a foreign country to at least know the basic rules because throughout all of north america you can film in public you don't need permissions you can just film live stream in public you can do whatever you want how do you not check this dude it was like one click away it took me like five seconds to look oh can i film anybody can i live stream in public could all of this be faked and staged to get him more attention yes would i be surprised if this is faked absolutely not we all know what kind of person neon is he does everything for cloud and anything for views and the thing is yeah people talk about it it goes viral on twitter people like me and others make videos on it but it really doesn't grow his page and i think he's got to realize this is not the way to go because sure people know you exist but they just watch the video they move on they don't watch the video and they're like i now want to see neon if that was the case i think he would have I don't know, half a million followers, if not a few million, because of all the attention he's been getting from every single commentary channel. People don't care about him. They don't care about his content. They just care about what's happening to him, what bad stuff is happening to him. This is where we got permission, ma'am. I want to let you know. So anyone who can clear this up is going to be in guest services as well. Oh, there's a Ripley's Believe It or Not. They didn't give us anything. They just they said yeah. they were gonna send. That's the they camera. They said they were gonna send. They took a picture of my passport and they said huh? they would send it to the WhatsApp group. Chat. Close, close, close. 
Yeah. Put it down, just put it down, bro. Put it down. What are you doing, bro? How is this guy 20 years old and this stupid? After watching that clip, I'm just like, you know what? I'd give him five years. And here we have one of his friends, Aiden Ross, coming to the rescue. And this is why this fucking kid never learns his lesson. It's because he always has people around him that are going to save him, that are going to defend him no matter what he does. I'm doing everything that I can do to try to help. But people around him made it really hard because there's clips like i'm not gonna say specifically who but you guys can put two and two together someone around them mocked them pretty bad to where it's, it's like they fucked it up i'm not gonna lie the only thing i'll say is it's sticky bro it's a very sticky situation because i see people my my crew talking about it and um it's not a script, bro. It's real life. The thing with people like Neon is that they've lied their whole career. I mean, this is the same kid who pretended to die like six different times on YouTube to get views and subscribers. Neon is a perfect example of the boy that cried wolf. And it's like, who's going to believe him at this point? And it's like, who genuinely cares if he gets arrested for a year? Here's the thing, right? If it turns out to be real and he gets locked away for a year, I'll oil up when we hit 500,000 subscribers. This is the only way he People like him are going to learn his lesson and not only him but every single other kick streamer who acts like him in hopes of getting big who cares if he gets arrested i don't think anyone in this comment section is going to be like no neon is going away for a year what will i do now my life has no meaning this is a very hard day for all the 10 year old neon fans my prayers are with you the more i think about it this might be 50 50 and by that i mean 50 percent real 50 percent fake i don't think anyone would be surprised by that he lied again that's new and what this is going to do, because I eventually do think he will be caught, what this is going to do is next time something serious happens to him, no one is going to care. People are going to make video, but no one's going to legitimately care about this dude. No one does. I don't even think that people around him care about him that much. They're just there to leech off his money, his clout, and his 25 seconds of fame before it dries out and next time you see Neon kidnapped by the Mexican cartel, it's gonna be like, sure, I'm sure that happened. And the only person that is to blame is Neon. I'm looking at this pills with 4 million views and the responses are just, thank God. <laughs> Deserved. Maybe streamers will stop harassing people when doing IRL streams now. We got what we wished for. Go to movie, by the way. Extremely underrated. This pack hit different. Yeah, we're definitely smoking that neon pack. So, yeah, everyone's just celebrating, having a good time. I can't blame them. I pray for this and happen. <laughs> if this is a downfall of neon, I'm staying prayed up. But at the same time, it's a double edged sword because now there will be no more content to make on neon. And now I will officially go home homeless and need to go get a real job so for my benefit i hope he's free free neon actually i'm gonna tweet that hashtag free neon neon he did nothing wrong free him i need to make more content off of him and his stupid ass that's all the information we have for now i will definitely keep you guys updated if anything else drops if anything crazy happens if there's a plot twist to make one thing clear i want to say this yes it is illegal to film without the proper permits unless it's for the reasons we took a look at earlier the other stuff with him being sentenced to one year and all of this other stuff that is yet to be seen hopefully it's real and if it is I will oil up at 500,000 subscribers. Subscribe.